Hello beautiful and welcome to The Prosperous Woman. One question I ask every potential client on every sales call is this, is your business a going concern? Do you plan to be in business for the long term, the next five years, 10 years, 15 years? Because here's the thing, when clients apply to work with me, they say things like, I want to start making 25K months, or I'm looking for 100K months, or maybe they want to go from 100K month to 250K month, or they want to make seven figures or their second or third seven figures. It's all about the numbers. And I like to ask, what is that intention behind the numbers? Because there's a feeling of desperateness when the only thing you think about is through the window and lens of a 10K month or 25K month or 50K month. You see in accounting, we have the concept of going concern, which means that your business will be in business and operations for the foreseeable long term, which means the next five years, 10 years, 15 years. And the reason why this is a perfect accounting concept for your coaching business is because it shapes how you make decisions in your business. It shapes your mindset so you can step away from the affirmations and all the things and actually focus on what works right now for you based on where you end your business. For example, it takes you away from the, the, the desperation of a 25K month or 100K month and puts you in a powerful driver's seat where you're self-led and say, okay, so in my five-year financial plan, I would love to create X amount of money. What strategies are going to work for me and how can I implement them consistent, consistently and sustainably so that my health improves, my lifestyle improves, and I don't have to get stressed out and sick trying to chase another 50K month. It takes you away from short-term vision to a long-term vision. When you are looking at the horizon of 18 months or three years, it's different from, pl for, from planning for a 10K month or a 25K month. It allows you to focus on strategies that work and not tactics. It shapes the way you think about your business. It shapes the decisions you make about investing in you and your business. And it shapes the strategies, the systems, and everything you use to create your high ticket sales and your profit. It's no longer a race. Creating a going concern concept in your business gives you the grace. It allows you to give yourself the grace to run the race God has given you at your own pace. There's no competition. You don't wake up one morning and look at somebody else who made seven figures in seven minutes yesterday and say, oh, I want to do that. It's not part of your seven year plan. But if that strategy will work for you, then you can, <clears throat> You can see God's wisdom on how to implement it in your business without the rush, without the desperation, without it has to happen now. And then you're able, because it's a long-term going concern, to create a cash reserve in your business and enough profitability so that you focus on the best way to sell for you. And then you attract the right people, the best fit clients for you, because you're not chasing people trying to create credit card numbers in another mastermind. Okay? So going concern concept matters because you're, it assumes that your business is going to continue to be in operations. And I ask women this all the time. Are you going out of business next year? What's the rush for the 100K month this month? Oh, it's just something I want to do because everybody in my mastermind is doing that this month. Focus on the race God has called you to run. Remember who you are and your work. It's not tied to the month or the XK month or the 50K. It's tied to the work you're doing in the world, your assignment, and your assignment is here for the long term. It's for your rest of your life. So plan based on that. Create five-year plans, 10-year financial plans, and give yourself the space to be creative. Give yourself the space to rest and work from a place of rest. This is how you're able to identify which high-ticket sales strategy work for you and how you can create the profitability you want in your business that allows you to have the cash reserves for everything you've ever dreamed of. Let me know how this lands for you.